Oh, it's turning yellow. Ah, damn it. Okay, what is that racket? What racket? Oh, now it's gone. And it's back. Yeah, I hear some weird, like, um, static thing. Oh, that's that's my microphone. I think my computer doesn't like my microphone anymore. Because no matter what I have done, no matter what I do to uh, to my microphone, it just won't fix it. I mean, is how old is the microphone? Not even a year, honey. Okay, that and is it's a blue Yeti. Which is supposed to be a good microphone. Okay, that is weird, then. Yeah. Okay. <sighs> I so, just don't know how to fix it. Am I on the blue floor? Third floor. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Okay, so that was in one or under one of these... I think that was under seven... What was under seven? Uh, um, I'm, right. just, I'm reading the map. Oh. And I know that they're going to be randomized. So this is the blue floor, apparently. I don't know why, but when I look at the map, it's uh, purplish. Yeah, it kind of it is colored a little purple here on this map. Interesting. Oh, it's getting warmer. Okay, so maybe it's at the fourth floor. Or maybe I'm at the highest floor. Oh, god damn it. Rouge, why didn't you grab the wall? What the hell? It's probably I mean, going up got... on the fourth floor. I mean, at least you got some rings to protect yourself. Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. All right, so now I'm on the fourth floor. Oh, it's turning uh... yellow, so it's got to be nearby. Thank you for pointing out the obvious, Chow. Yeah, really. Oh, yeah, almost got Chow it. is obnoxious. All right, so I mean, a lot of people actually like him. Yeah, Hold I, on. I did. Go, actually, back, I did. go back to the go back to the entrance down there. Over here? There you got green, so it's so it's down, so it's down on the lower floor somewhere. I mean, I did once ask the um, hypothetical question. I mean, which one was worse, Chow or Navi from the Legend from uh, Navi's Ocarina worse. Time? Yeah. yeah, everyone says Navi's worse. Okay, so it's nearby here. Not to get mixed up with the word Nani, because they're spelled so similarly. Nani the fuck. Nani the fuck? Nani? There's a reason why I hate that word. Why? Because it mixed me up with that and Navi when I was playing Zelda. <laughs> I first heard Nani as the older sister to Lilo in Lilo and Stitch. Oh Shit. yeah, same. It That's look... her name. I like... I'm going to... Oh, it's in one of those safes. <sighs> You're so close to... Uh, I'm going like... to squish. Okay, Ooh. so here's a question, Misty. Is it one switch that activates all the safes, or is it uh, just a selective ones? The switches activate uh, the individual floors, but only one floor can be activated at a time. Oh, that's such is bullshit. Is how it works. Yeah, that's one reason why I hate this level. If you if it's behind a safe uh, that on a floor that you haven't gotten unlocked at the moment, it is bullshit. You have to go all the way back just to turn it on. 
This Ugh. is literally the level you have to try and learn how to speed run. So yeah, it starts with a blue floor unlocked, and if the emerald is behind a safe, that is... Or, right now it's starting with the yellow one unlocked. But if, it, but if it's not behind a yellow safe, you're shit out of luck. Alright, so... Oh dear. And what's this one? Collecting all the rings? No, I'm not here for the rings. Alright, let's go back to that page... Ring map, okay. Oh. Emerald map and ring map. Okay, so they don't have ones for switches? Are you serious? Mm -mm. That's so dumb! All the switches are on the top floor. That's the thing. It's just whether or not you uh, need to activate which one. That's why I do a fly around, see where I'm getting the ping, and if it's behind a place that I need to unlock, then I go back. But I try to be fast about it. This took me so long to figure out how to do, trust me. Oh. Ah. Get some rings! You yeah, got I'm... some nearby. Yes, there is. Alright, so it's around this corner somewhere. Okay, it's It yellow. might be... It might be what? It might be- It's not above you. That is so odd. It might be below you, but in that same general vicinity. Alright. Yeah, try jumping below you, but going in that same general facility- vicinity. Facility. Oh, it's moved, moved away. Damn it. Shut up, Eggman! I wish you could turn him off. It's like, ah, collect him now! I'm working on it! I mean, let's be honest, he's not as bad as Lex Luthor in, um, Superman 64. Mm. Well, no... Dude, no game is... Dude, no game is worse than Superman 64. Yeah, that is true. That's just I mean, that's maybe unanimously hated game. Yeah, I mean, I've never played it, nor have I heard of it, and somehow I'm glad I have it. Consider okay, yourself so, lucky. Yeah. Long story short, Misty, that game is incredibly broken, and it kind of is a very big middle finger to the original Superman cartoon. Like, if you like the ah. original Superman cartoon, you're gonna hate. Superman 64. God damn Oof. it. Oh my god. Jump over. Oh god. You need a ring! Dude, this stage is absolute garbage. Dude, what the fuck was up with this stage? CO3, Chaos Emeralds in five minutes. You know, they should have just made it ten, or even eight minutes. Or better yet, they should have just had the Emeralds only, like, just specifically in three places. Yeah, Instead of just true. randomizing it all the fucking time. They, they thought it would be less, or less of a challenge if they were always set. There's a difference, all the no, like, there's a difference between a challenge and just frustration. Yeah. God damn it! <laughs> But then again, there's always there's always that one argument that people have is, but what if frustration can be entertaining? And to be no. honest, no, it's not. That's why so many people hate games like I Want to Be the Guy or most infamously that fucking um, getting over with, getting it over. Yeah, the whole thing is like, oh, you're supposed to work with your wits and everything, and it's so rewarding at the end. No, it's just not fun. The controls are dog shit. I mean, considering the fact that most notably getting over, I mean, especially with getting over it, considering that Markiplier, who's usually, like, one of the more chiller Let's Players, he was raging in, hard. He, not only was he raging hard, but he flat out said it was the most frustrating game he ever played, and he would never, and it literally made him miserable. Get off. And considering... Get and off. considering that this is the guy who literally played I Am Bread and Octo and Octodad, that is saying a lot. You play a game for fun. 
not to piss yourself off. Yeah, no, like, there's a video by the name of, uh, it's like Frosty something. He made a recent mm -hmm. video about NES games, and he had a bit of a hot take where NES games are often considered bad game design. But he also elaborated the detail that good level design didn't exist yet. Uh, the level designs were made to quote-unquote steal your quarters because that's what the companies were focused on. Afterwards, yeah. they would focus on good level design or level design that's actually worth the time. Because um, arcades were starting to become more uh, dated and the developers had to change things. So, wait a minute. I think I'm starting to see a pattern here. I'm guessing that this is supposed to be... Get me down! Dude, what the hell? Why won't it let me go down? I'm not working. God damn it. Shut up, Robotnik! Robotnik, no one likes you. Also, I'm that one person who absolutely hates when people call Dr. Robotnik Eggman, considering that was his original name. It's Eggman, not Robotnik. It's Robotnik, not Eggman. Then maybe you I shouldn't have given him two nicknames. I mean, I, I mostly blame the fact that the game just gave him two nicknames. Let's just pick up whichever one. Does it really have to matter? For some purists, he's always Eggman. For some modernist, he's always Robotnik. Oh, 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 box, box, hit the box. Hit the box, thank you. Punch the box. Attack the rainbow, taste the rainbow. Really? Taste the rainbow? Ooh. Hit him, oh my god. Okay. I'm just remembering the, that one. Use the hint. My advice. Use the hint. Where's that? Where's that? Uh, behind you. Okay. A place where you use the most electricity. Where would the, the most electricity? What does that mean? Yeah, where would the most... This whole place is an electric factory. Robotnik, shut the fuck up. Is it in one of these Sub safes? Submissive. Oh, no, no. Oh. It turned yellow. Hello. The fan? Here, jump off. Oh, hold on. I think it might be one of those, uh, one of those, uh... Yellow ones? No, I think it's one of those monsters with the yellow, uh, with the electric, uh, field. I think you need to break one of them, and it'll give you the emerald. It's on that second, it's on that second floor. All right, give me a second. Let me try to make my way up there. Punch. Yeah, punch that thing. No. God damn yep. it. Or kick it or something. Press B after the field goes away. There, there you go. You might actually win yeah. it this time. I'm not going to get too cocky here. I just have to browse around and then figure it out. Oh, let's see what these things have to say. Shows up Shows. once in a while. Okay, that's what not... What does that mean? Yeah, that's not going to explain shit. Okay, we're getting close. What does this say? A dark room. A dark room. What dark what? room? Does it look like there's a dark room? Wait a minute. Could it Go be a... upstairs. Go upstairs. All right, so... Up, up the lever. That's the darkest room in this in this game. That's oh okay. god, motherfucker! Shows uh, up every once in a while. Oh wait, what was that missing? Let, go, Shut go, up go, up go ahead. Uh, try going up. All right, up the next level. No, don't do that again. I want to see if it turns yellow up here. It's yellow. Yeah, it's somewhere up here then. Oh, it's green. Here? No, yeah, it's back to green. 
But I think so. I didn't know that that was there. Uh, go into the middle. All right, give me a second. Camera, come on. I think it's. I think it's somewhere in the, in this area. This is the darkest room. Yeah. Oh. It's somewhere. There it is. I I can't look down. No. Give me a ring. Give me a ring. It, okay, go back up on that on that thing and wait for it to come back up and then jump. All right, give me up. On the lever. Careful. Ring, no, ring. not oh, the lever. Mm. You gotta be very careful now. You almost got it. See, look, it's oh, popping I, I, up. I see. Oh, oh no! Shit! Uh... You close! I was so goddamn close. That was almost. Ugh. That was almost perfect. I mean, at least he knows where it is now. It's well, randomized. Yeah. God damn it, I forgot about that. You can- wait, no, no, no. You still survived. You can go back. Go back. Go back to where it was. You didn't- you didn't completely- uh, you didn't completely go- uh, you didn't completely reset. You need to go back up there. Go back oh. up there. It's still there. Oh, you shit. You didn't reset the level. Yeah, I'm going, I'm going, I'm going. I just realized, I saw the timer, and I'm like, wait, that's way too small. I realized you didn't reset the level. Okay. I did not know that I would still continue. Wait, has it been relocated? It has! Okay, that's bitchy! It shouldn't have done that! 